Merry Christmas everyone, it's December 25 and here I am doing a video. I plan to um, send this away, so um, before I do that, um, I'm going to make a video. And this is my very first uh, Mark Cross um, handbag review ever. I've owned a vintage um, Mark Cross coated canvas before and um, uh, it's not with me anymore. It was a very tiny um, crossbody bag. So here it is. This is in a vintage style and um, it's a very simple one and I, I just love the leather. I think it's uh, uh, thinner than uh, the Vachetta leather. And um, this is the vintage style. However, um, this bag has not been used much because it's still in gorgeous condition so i bought this online and um let me uh show you the bag closely okay so um in the pictures i thought this was like a cloth because um the uh, uh the description was it says um cloth like and leather like materials so um I'm not sure if uh, if you know the seller knows what uh, <laughs> this handbag is. Clearly, Mark Cross handbags are made of leather. Although it is not a very popular brand, it has been here long enough. And I thought Mark Cross handbags were made in Spain because the last time that I had was I think made in um, Spain or was that Italy? I can't even remember. Um, it's not all over your face, but um, uh, this um, this emblem or this sign is um, uh, that of Mark Cross. So if you could see the um, the gold uh, plaque there. So this bag is absolutely in gorgeous condition. It's in mint condition, guys. And I think they're making a comeback with their Grace Box bag. Um, they are uh, priced in the thousands and um, it's sold by Barney's New York. So it's pretty much, um, you know, when I think of Mark Cross, I think of pens because um, that was one of my coveted pens when I was still working at the hotel, at the reception, I was at the front desk and I did not like any other um, pens you know i'm very particular with uh, my ball pens and i just i just had to guard it with my life and i think one of the guests gave me uh, a mark cross uh pen and some other um fancy pen um brands i've forgotten what it was but what it is but i don't have them anymore and at some point i was keeping it for I, I think i kept it for a long time although um it has obviously ran out of ink but anyway so here it is it is in um medium uh size i would say medium size too large and um this can be worn cross body or just uh, plainly as a shoulder bag there are um, whole adjustments here and you can just see that it's absolutely gorgeous um, I don't see any any um, signs of wear at all and um, here is the back it would have been perfect if there was at least an open pocket in the back and um, I'm just not sure what kind of material this is because um, it's not uh, uh, a coated coated canvas is I think it's thinner than a coated canvas and it's not cloth either as opposed to what was um, listed originally and um, I was um, even amazed to see uh, you know the condition of this bag it's even more beautiful and it's even more perfect in person so uh, yeah look at this this is like a vachetta like Vachetta like uh, and it says Italy Italy over there and um, and um, the the hardware is absolutely absolutely uh, very um, shiny look at that okay if I could um, so let me just see I'm filming this by myself guys so um, <laughs> maybe moving a lot so I hope I don't make you uh, 
um, dizzy. Okay, so there you go. That's interior of the bag. It's just um, uh, a tan, um, smooth, it's not smooth, like leather, pebble leather uh, lining. And it says here, Mark Cross, made in Italy. Let me see if there is, oh, there is actually a serial number in the back. Hmm. And it uses a YKK zipper. So, um, I've been reading the history of this handbag and um, all I knew was that I thought they started as a, uh, as a pen, uh, uh, pen company, but it was actually, it's, uh, it's pretty, it's a very, very old company. It was started in 1845 and this was already popular in the United States uh, long before the Gucci Hermes came into existence. So I was really surprised that, you know, what I discovered upon reading the Mark Cross history, 1845, it was started in New York by this Irish, uh, uh, um, Henry Henry Cross, but he named it the company after his son. So um, that was just the extent. <laughs> I just wanted a brief background of Mark Cross. And the handbags are available in um, Barney's, Barney's.com. Oh, okay, so um, there, there, there are some, um, I think, scratches there. So I think this is a, a little um, more sensitive than um, the coated canvas, but you know, I think that's that must have been from um, from storage. I'm not sure, but this is in absolutely gorgeous condition. It's very roomy and it's um, very light as well. So uh, I'm not sure if there are any Mark Cross uh, handbag reviews um, in here, but um, I'm happy to you know partake my you know review or my insight on this handbag. It's you know everything is just. It's perfect. Okay. I, I love it. I love it. Okay. So there you go. Bye.